Hey everybody, how you guys doing? I'm doing alright. Alright guys, it's been reported probably by a long list of sources. Mark Zuckerberg is now supposedly the sixth richest in the world. I don't know if that's to the Western nations only because we all know that private organizations have a lot more money and we know there are billionaires that have numbers into the trillions. So this guy here, as much as you want to say he he's up there with them killing Gaddafi for doing the uh, gold back, uh, African francophone currency and everything else, I wouldn't I wouldn't put him anywhere near those guys. I'd put him in the tech world, probably closer to Bill Gates and stuff of that nature. He's basically the Bill Gates of our time. Eh, not much I want to really say about Mark Zuckerberg. Um, so, I just wanted to report this and put this out there. This is done by Fortune. Uh, supposedly, folks... And you might want to spread this. Mark Zuckerberg has surpassed the Koch brothers. He's a 31-year-old CEO of Social Network and now worth $47 billion, making him sixth richest person on earth. You know what? I'm so sick and tired of them lowballing these numbers. I mean, the guy gave like $42 billion to like his his daughter in her own trust fund and then that money basically doubles so this guy's worth upwards i'm gonna guess probably 300 to 400 billion dollars even if he only has 47 in a bank Ooh. sorry i don't believe that bullshit for a moment uh is also coming out of bloomberg uh, you can say what you want about Facebook and its stock and what it's doing Thursday, what it's doing this way and that way, and whether or not it's worth its 1.5 or 1.2 billion each year. But Zuckerberg has his hands in a lot of stuff. They even talk about here with the falling oil prices and everything. The tech stocks are basically the only thing really floating in the world. Mentions Amicio Ortega at seventy billion, Warren Buffett at fifty nine billion, Jeff Bezos at fifty two billion, Carlos Slim at forty eight. But those are just like normal billionaires. Those aren't like the sheiks that are worth countries worth of money. I mean we're talking about the people who basically have you know, a trillion in assets. I mean what was what was Gaddafi worth? Gaddafi, when he died, was like the first or the second richest person in the world. That's why they killed him, by the way. And he had like nine hundred billion dollars in assets. I mean, it was it was like very close to be. I think it was even one point two trillion dollars in assets. I mean, it was just so much of a ridiculous number. That's why they killed him. That. And basically everything else. So supposedly Zuckerberg has surpassed the Koch brothers. I disagree. Those guys are international bankers. They have their name and their number in every damn investment firm, holding firm, everything you can name. I highly doubt for a moment. I don't care how many connections Zuckerberg has. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm a geek. I like my numbers. I like my stats. There is no way in, you know what, that Zuckerberg is worth more than probably $227 billion, where the Koch brothers have been alive for decades, folks. Now, say what you want about inflation of their money versus inflation of his money and where the money actually reaches, but Net wise, I guarantee the the Koch brothers have lots more invested. I mean, I'm not even going to say it's not possible. I just know the real way the real world works, and I know that <laughs> there's no way that Zuckerberg is passing those guys. 
I mean, they list like Warren Buffett and Armancio Ortega and Bezos and Carlos Slim, but they haven't mentioned any of the Chinese billionaires that folded it up that had like over a hundred billion. They're, they're not even going to go into the people that have like the super billions of dollars because you know we would basically say, oh well, uh, <laughs> he's not really rich at all. Of course not. He he's basically a centralized banking billionaire prodigy. He's not the guy that owns the companies that that basically bring in the world and the reality that we have. I guarantee you those five or six guys that run the whole world full of media that own Fox, that own all these other things, I guarantee you those guys are worth trillions. Easily. I mean, they have... Uh, all, all those guys, including including Zuckerberg, have oil in the Middle East. They have this, they have that. You know, it's all banked and sponsored for. But I highly doubt for a moment Zuckerberg is, you know, the sixth biggest person in the world. No, sorry, I, I, I don't. I, I, I disagree. I can name four or five off record that I know that are like, and, and 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 that one that one I did um of the Chinese billionaires when the market was going down the ones that were leaving China those guys were worth like a hundred and six billion dollars and they left they took their money they closed up and they left so there's no way in H E L L that this guy is worth what those guys were sorry he is maybe I would say number. 1100 on the list, but he is not number six. Thank you.